Well, hello mates and welcome back to The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. In the last episode, I said I'd play some greed mode. So guess what we're doing today? It is of course greed mode. We're going to start off with a nice little random run and then depending on how well that goes, we will move on to Azazel because that of course is what we need to unlock Lilith. And interestingly about Azazel, I've heard because I've been reading Twitter that he's been quite badly nerfed. Oh Judas, this is going to be interesting. Hmm. But yeah, I heard that Azazel was quite badly nerfed. Um, gotta say, I didn't really feel that in our um, in our previous run, because that was a very successful run as Azazel. Of course, when you get the items that we get, nothing feels nerfed regardless of whoever you're playing with. Uh, yeah, of whoever you're playing with. But yeah, a lot of people on Twitter were saying, Brah, grumble, 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 Azazel sucks now. And I don't know, I didn't see it. Maybe there's been an update since I last played, because it has been a couple of days. Or as I said, maybe we didn't notice because we just got great items. But anyway, welcome to Greed Mode if you haven't seen it before. Starting as Judas is interesting. We get lots of damage but not much health, meaning we can't even go into our curse room just yet. I'm not going to explain too much about gr what Greed Mode is. Oh, that's going to help out a lot actually because it's quite obvious when you see it work. What I am interested about is the Book of Belial. Is the Book of Belial effect going to work for the whole thing? Because if it is, then that's actually fantastic. Normally it works for one room. Technically, greed mode is all just one room. We just have our shop up here that we can buy anything from. Of course, unfortunately, we can't yet. Actually, what we'll do is we'll go in here and get two coins, okay? And then we'll go back out of here and we'll buy that heart. And as you can see, it goes back straight away. That's basically how it works here. It's going to be very interesting. I'm really interested to see how the Book of Elias is going to affect our situation. Hopefully, well, in theory, that was really poor damage. But in theory, it will last forever. As long as we don't leave the room. I think it is. Oh man, Judas is a great character to play as for Greed Mode. Never considered that synergy. Fantastic. Very, very pleasing indeed. Alright, so as you can see, every wave we beat, we get ourselves some money. When we beat the waves, we're going to have access to that shop there. Where we can buy lots of things. Hopefully a key. And we can get into our item room. And it basically goes on like this. You'll see how it works. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, lots of enemies about the shop now. Okay, this can happen. This can happen. We'll stay up here because I think a lot of those enemies were immobile. Okay. It it's okay as Judas, so things are going well. We just got to be very careful because obviously we're not allowed, or we can't allow for too many mistakes when we're playing as J-Dog. J-Money, whatever. Or the traitor. Okay, let's just keep well out of us. Oh man, that was... I'm going to say unfortunate. Could have probably seen it happening. Fantastic that we still got the Book of Belial effect, though. We just want to be very, very careful right now. Um, I think this is the last wave because it's not counting down anymore. So we should be able to go and replenish our health. Brilliant. And now we have to get the boss thing as well. But we've got lots of money. So let's go spend that money first. Yeah, that was close. Every wave we beat, it also recharges our item. So... In theory, we're going to have... We actually bought two keys there by accident. But in theory... We're going to have the Book of Belial every time, aren't we? That's fantastic. And that is split shot. That is interesting. How is this going to affect our range? Normally it kills range and it appears to have killed range here. Okay, we're going to go and buy some health if we can. We sure can. In fact, we can get up to max and I'm going to. And we're going to go and beat the hell out of Monstro or someone. It's actually, oh, it's this guy. This guy, I forgot if he's good or not. Uh, I mean, he's pretty, seems pretty weak. He went down already. Oh, oh, Jesus, that could have gone badly. Okay, couple of monstros here. Of course, the way we're talking about if a boss is hard or easy, you know, we've got Book of Belial all the time. We're playing as G. Oh, that's poor. That's poor. But luckily, I don't know. I feel like it's more forgiving in terms of dumb, dumb damage, Greed Mode. But it is really fun. I think some people thought it was going to be a bit of a novelty, but it really isn't. And that's that. So let's. Yeah, there's not really much to buy here, is there? I'd love Champion's Belt if we can get it. And I was dumb to leave the room there because now we've lost what's it, haven't we? If we fight another round, we do get a deal with the devil. So let's do that. No, oh, it's just going to be a couple of these. couple of these. Oh, and a proper dingle as well somewhere. Oh, God, and some of those absolute buttholes. And they are buttholes. Oh, and apparently there's some minging little thing in the ground. One of those pink poops that I absolutely despise. Let's not do anything silly. There we go. That was silly. That guy can charge four times before he needs a breather, unlike the normal Dingle. Okay. We don't need to do anything 
So he's charging four times. We know that now. And again then, son. That's the ticket. There we go. So a champion version of Dingle that I've not seen before. Hasn't proven to be too much of an issue. And there we go. So we do get our deal with the devil. Don't want to fight Krampus right now. We're not going to fight Krampus. We're actually going to pick up some health. We oh, fantastic. Okay, that's very nice indeed. Brilliant. So that's basically how greed mode works, guys. Um, we've already got a key. Let's go down to the next floor. What we'll be looking for really is range, mainly above all else, I think. Obviously, it would always take damage. The ability to fly a lot can be used for what range, I think, is the big one right now. Certainly what we want. So we're going to fight our way through it again. We're in the caves now. Let's pop ourselves down here. We'll open up what we can get. HP is HP, I guess. We can trade it away in the deal with the devil. That is horrible and disappointing and absolutely not worth a key. That I desperately, desperately want. In fact, I want both of those items, to be honest. Um, so let's hope we do get enough money to get that. We'll head in here and we'll pick up Guppy's head. Oh my god, I called it. Okay, and um, we're going to take a bit of a hit in the process. Our Book of a Lion has to take precedent, I think, over Guppy's head. Uh, I'm actually going to buy that to contradict myself entirely. We'll try and keep our black hearts alive. So as much as Guppy's head's great, I like it mainly because it's a Guppy item. We're not getting rid of the Book of Belial for anything. Speaking of which, we should probably employ its usage right now. Because we're killing we're killing things in relatively quick hits right now, which is really, really, really good. Like to be breaking these open in one shot. But, you know, that's pretty much dream scenario. So, yeah, in case you're wondering, if we beat the current floor before the timer goes down we get a breather oh apparently we don't i thought we got a breather and we were allowed to go to our shop midway through whether that's gonna happen i don't really feel the need to i feel like our current setup is more than enough to deal with this situation get rid of these guys pretty quickly very simply done okie dokie that's the ticket oh okay that's a bit tricky no we got it we're good we good hombres which is what I'd call you if I was Mexican. Is that Mexican? Good day, hombres, and welcome to... Maybe I could coin that expression. Okay, there we go. So, yeah, these runs are generally a little bit quicker. I've never actually completed a greed run. Um, but I have got quite, I think, close. We need to buy a key. No, we don't. We've already been in there. Okay, well, that's that then. Let's fight some bosses. We've got matchsticks, which I think gives us a little bit of range. We're doing a decent amount of damage to Mega Fatty here. It could be better. That was poor damage. Forgot how quick he is on his jump there. I thought we had a little bit more time. That's the ticket. We want to be keeping away. Yeah. Not often you can get Mega Fatty this slow with just consistent shots. Who'd be next? A Chub. That is Chub, isn't it? Chub shouldn't be too much of an issue for us. We just beat Mega Fatty. I don't think Chub's going to be too worthy an adversary. Are we good? Yep, yeah, we good. Okay, and we can go and buy luck for. Hopefully we get something that allows us to use that. And Nun's Habit is probably not worth it in this format, I don't think. Okay, we've got another couple of coins down here. Brilliant. Let's go fight more bosses. Oh, I've done the mistake again, haven't I? I've done the mistake where I don't get to use Book of Belial this time. Gotta, gotta remember it's a three-charge item. We probably want to be saving charges. Okay. Bad play there. We don't, I said I wanted to save the black carts. Might be losing one here. No reason to. You don't really need to take damage against... Mega Moore, I believe this guy is. I dare say if anyone's going to, it'll be me, though. I mean, we're getting him down. We are getting him down pretty effectively. He's not spitting out any enemies, which is... Okay, I take that back. Come on, keep, with the, keep with the purple stuff that we can trace. There we go. Okay, that wasn't too bad, was it? Right, deal with the devil. No Krampus. Not in the mood for Krampus. Oh, this again. Hey! Gets rid of some stuff, but it's a second guppy item. we still got decent HP. Not great co not great amount of coins. I mean, we bought items with them. I will just buy a key because it's half price and it allows us into our item room straight away next next floor. So let's go do it. There's sometimes enemies in this situation. No tinted rocks either. Swings and roundabouts, I guess. Okay, but yeah, I very much enjoy greed mode. So let's go to the areas that we can. I don't want to go into our curse from... Curse of the maze. Okay, that's going to be annoying. Damn it! Come on! There we go. I guess she'll help a bit, Sister Maggie. And we get some more HP as well. Okay. Yeah, I would like to go into our curse room. Would love a spirit heart first. So maybe some coins if we can buy one in here. For God's sake. 
Yeah, so maybe if we can get some coins together and then buy a spirit heart in here. Oh, it's not for sale unless we get a bomb. Oh, but there are no bombs for sale. No spirit hearts. Okay, well, we have no choice then. Let's go and do it. We got to because we're one item away from Guppy. So there's absolutely no excuse to not do this. Well, that's disappointing. I'll be honest. Oh, that's even worse. Oh, right. Let's ignore like that happened. We've got a couple. Of Wait, what hit us there? Okay, let's just ignore the last minute happened there. We're good. We got Belial active. We got some coins together. I'm going to stay in here. We're going to fight all the enemies. Oh, God, it's the brimstone ones. It looks like they're only on this wall, though, so that's not too bad. Okay. We're actually getting quite an easy set of enemies here to fight, I have to be honest. The kind of stuff where Judas does quite well. So all we have to do is stand here and bang. Yeah, that's that bit done. These guys are a little bit tanky, but our damage is such that I don't think we need to worry too much about that. Sister Maggie helping out like the true MVP that she is. These are just the Leech Belcher things, not the Brimstone ones, so that's not too scary. Hoping to get the kill there, but that's not a problem. Oh my god, this is still going. There we go. Hello. Man, they went down quick. Okay, that's very pleasing. Very pleasing indeed. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. It's a good greed mode so far. I like the Belial synergy, and that's us there. Right, now, was there anything worth buying in here? Don't really want box. Don't really want uh, pill bag. Don't really want... I think that's Mum's Eye. Don't want it anyway. Would love a bomb. We don't have a bomb. Nothing to do then. Let's continue fighting. Come on. Immediately spawned creep. I guess that was our fault in a way, but I don't like to admit things are my fault, really. As you can imagine. All right, let's just get him down. Health is still going down pretty quick. Get out of him. I mean, we're one item away from Guppy. Guppy is a win, I think. Guppy and then just some sort of item that can guarantee us some health, whatever it may be. I know that's a lot to ask for, but... Hey, it's Christmas soon. It's November. Christmas lists are getting sent off to Santa. If I can't ask for Satanic Bible... Oh, God. Oh, this thing. I've only seen this once, and our damage was so good at the time that we killed it instantly. I don't think we're going to have such a luxury here, and this actually seems to be quite a nasty boss. It's knocking a lot of the stuff at us. Oh, heavens. Mr. Corny Poop, man. I do not like you at all. No, thank you. Oh, goodness, mate. I, I panic-pressed Belial there. No! Oh, my heavens, no! No, 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 no! We'll have enough of this, thank you. Enough of this. Enough of this. Woo! Okay. Damn, damn, we need to go buy some health. That went poorly, right. So we'll buy that, and then there was one to pick up. I'm also going to buy a key while we can. And there was some health there. My god, that was scary. Okay, now we're not going to have Belial this time. Oh, we're only fighting Loki. Two Lokis, though. Two Lokis, and one of which has already split off. It's okay. I wouldn't consider Loki one of the harder bosses. Although we have taken damage somewhere. There's a lot of things on the screen. Normally, Loki's easy because you can blow these things up on him. We don't seem to have the damage to do that right now. It's okay. Oh, man. Their health is not going down particularly quickly. We've got the Loki that's cut himself in half as well. Come on. No, oh, no, they're going to turn up. Okay, they're up here. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. We can take our time with this. We'll take our time with this. No one's rushing us. That was done. We nearly blew ourselves up on him. That's the ticket. No, that's not the ticket. That's actually quite a poor ticket. Oh, God. Oh, God. These things are... If we can just get rid of one, but we're already... Oh, damn. There was too much to look at there, but nine lives is going to help out. Okay. I mean, we can just pass this one by right now. We have the option to. You know what? Now we know what it's going to be. Let's have one more go. we got nine goes with this. Is it two half Lokis again? We'll just concentrate on this guy. Concentrate on this guy. For as much as we can. Oh, God. I don't even know what's hitting us half the time. I swear I didn't see anything there. Let's try once more. The problem is, because we've got uh, Cricket's body, I can't quite tell what are our shots and what are not our shots. Because they look identical in a, lo in a Loki fight. So it is a tad tricky. And the fact that we're still three shots to take that. Means that our glorious start may very well have remained with unfulfilled, uh, unfulfilled potential. Like one of those wonder kids in football that you just don't hear about anymore. And it turns out they're 28 and still only as good as they were when they were 15. Despite the fact they were going to take on the world. Like that Freddie Adu in America. He was supposed to be the next best player in the world. And... 
He just stayed as good as he was when he was 16 all the way through his career. Sadly. Oh! Should have got out of the way of that. Right, let's pass this one by. We've no need for it. We've no need for it. We can still pass greed mode here. So, on to Le Womb. We've got a key. We just need some nice stuff here. God, it all looks... Oh, my lord. Don't know what that is. And that's Peeper Eye. I think Peeper Eye in this scenario... Oh, that's Proptosis. Well, it won us a run last time we picked up Proptosis. And that's the good screw. Okay. We're very damagey right now. Let's take... What is damaging us when we start? Come on. Is there another one about the shop somewhere? Oh, no. We can just open up. Well, let's see what's in here. Yes. Thank you so much. Oh, my goodness. How generous this is all. How generous indeed. And synth oil as well. We are sure as hell going to be saving up for that. Okay. Oh, the spikes come up immediately after. Right. So if we linger, then we don't get spiked. Proptosis I'm very much enjoying right now. Very, very much enjoying. I think Proptosis might have saved us a bit here. Oh, they like little... Okay, then they turn into them. They look like little, I don't know, gurglings or something. Come on. Okay, couple of meanie nasty flies. We're going to have to deal with them first, I imagine. That's the ticket. Open up, son. Good lad. What I'd love, another item I'd love. Oh, God, didn't see that coming. Shielded Tears. Shielded Tears would be huge right now. Shielded Tears seriously would be massive for us. Obviously, because Proptosis... Oh, damn it! No! How has this happened? How are we allowing such things to happen? Right, there's coins on the floor. Let's go buy Synth Oil right now. It's going to help with our range as well. We can get Belial going. And it's all... all ah, and Torn Photo. Fantastic. This is quite considerably good. These things are annoying because... I mean, who who can tell when they're shooting at us, right? So maybe we should just... I don't know. Take them out when we see them. Otherwise, we know... We know, we know we've know we learned a bit. We're using our nine lives here to kind of learn something about the floor. Come on. Oh, damn! I forgot they were down there. Apparently, I'm not learning quite enough. Oh, my lord. Heavens. Shielded Tears will win here. Shielded Tears and we win. Mum's... Uh, is that Mum's Contact? No, Mum's Contact's a freeze effect, isn't it? We need the um, other contact. Lost Contact, that's the name of it. Okay, are all these down now? We're on 8 out of 10. Oh, brilliant. Okay, we beat the time. Oh, I haven't got that many coins. Were there some down here? No, there were not. Well, at least we can buy some health. Oh, brilliant. We can buy Spirit Heart as well. That's going to be very useful because I like our situation right now. But we've lost Belial. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. Because look how quickly his he went down there. And are we going to get enough of Torn Photo? I think... What the hell is that? Is that two or three Scorlaxes? Together, that is hideous. That is truly, truly hideous. Oh my heaven. This is going to be tricky, I think. And they're champion ones as well. Ugh. Right, we'll get Belial back up and running. Come on, more damage. More damage and we're good. That's what we want. Okay, that was really, really, really effective, actually. That should do something for us there. Brilliant. Okay, come on. Where you at, bro? Where you at? Get up. Show me your bum. No, not quite. Not quite. We've got one hit on him. Not enough. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, we messed up right at the end. Come on. Give me the opportunity I crave. Oh, God, no. That was so bad. Ugh. Shouldn't be a hard fight, this. Shouldn't be a hard fight at all. Let's just keep moving. When they pop up, they're easy as anything. Like, like this situation. See? Look how much damage we just did there. It was loads. We just got to keep moving. Or we could just run into the rock where we can't see anything. We shouldn't be dying to this kind of situation. I've got to be honest. Um, don't even know what happened there. My keyboard was just like, nope, no, David. Nope, nope. We don't like being on three lives. 
Well, we're, we're technically now on three lives, but... Oh, come on. Come on! Ugh! Can't believe we lost from a minute ago when we had all that health and... Ugh. Doesn't bear thinking about... That's what we want! Damn it! They're teaming up on us! Oh! God! No! Right. Let's try this again. Right. <laughs> Let's try this again. Where are they at now? Our last chance. I feel like our play has been poor here. Considering the item... Okay. Right. Azazel. It's Azazel's turn. Let's unlock Lilith. Let's do it. Let's do it for Lilith. Right, so the ability to fly will help us out in the curse rooms. Let's find something good here. Speed up. Oh, man, yeah. Actually, I'm feeling this, actually. This supposed nerf. His range seems a lot less. His charge time seems a hell of a lot more for a shot. They're all rubbish items, sadly. Okay, this may be interesting. Oh my goodness me. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm pressing what I've, like, sort of learnt myself in a schema as what is his charge time, and he's not charging. I guess he has been nerfed in an update. That would have killed him a minute ago. Oh my god, he sucks! Oh, no, why didn't I do this challenge before it, the nerf? Oh, look how long that is. Look how long it takes to kill an enemy as well. Oh, God, this is awful. No, 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 no. They're not dying! They would kill. Azazel would kill in that situation before. Look at this now. What have they done to him? Oh, I understand what Twitter was talking about. They've ruined Azazel, the most interesting... Well, one of the best characters in the game. The whole point of some of the characters is that they're just better. And you get the ability to fly, but then you have to deal with... The, we're using a black heart to get rid of that. That was intentional, by the way. Oh, no. No, I don't like this nerf. I don't like this nerf at all. Look how long things take to die. He's just... He is absolutely the worst character now. And I'm, I'm making mistakes here, because I'm, like, holding my finger down for the amount of length that my fingers think it takes for Azazel to charge up a shot, and it's just not happening, and... Ugh. Well, that's been some unsuccessful greed mode. Tune in tomorrow for some successful greed mode, maybe. Thanks for watching. Um, very sad about Azazel there. That's, 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 that's upsetting. I think we can all agree that Isaac is indefinitely, undisputedly the best character now. But yeah, RIP Azazel is all I have to say.